LG G Style Little Beast Mobile User HD here, and today I'm gonna video about Google here and the Google Play Store here and when I'm downloading apps and shit. So basically, the title of this article says Google testing a feature that prevents an app from downloading from downloading the ability to save the network, guys. I'm on FannyOne.com, so uh, yeah, this is very interesting. So, so let's see really what it has to say about it. Um, this is very interesting, guys. Um, so it says, it says, according to Lick Images, Google is testing out a feature that will save Android users from expanding their precious data when downloading apps from the Play Store. This is accomplished by enabling a setting, by enabling a setting that will prevent apps from downloading on your device until the phone or tablet is hooked up to a Wi-Fi network. But if you guys download an app now, if you, if you download, if you download like an art, a, a large app, it will ask you if you want to connect to Wi-Fi or do you want to continue. So uh, it uh, it does ask you before you download it, do you want to connect to Wi-Fi or continue? And it will give you a warning and all that shit. It says previously Google would alert users when they were about to download a large file that could eat their that could eat through a user's monthly data allowance. With the new feature, Google will offer Android users a choice between waiting for a Wi-Fi hookup before downloading the app or to have it downloaded right at that moment regardless how much data will be used to accomplish this. Since it is being tested right now, some Android users might see this option on the screen while downloading an app. If you do get the option to choose between Download a file now or waiting for Wi Fi. So, I'd like the latter will automatically start the download process shortly after you are connected to a Wi Fi network. You don't have to click on anything to start the download. So, I guess when this uh, thing is rolled out completely, what it'll do is you download an app and it tells you that you wait for Wi Fi network and you gotta do something else. It will, uh, it will, uh, delay the download and once you connect to Wi Fi. It will start downloading, uh, downloading the app or game or whatever, so you don't have to do anything. It should start downloading in, uh, automatically. So, uh, yeah. And the next paragraph says, uh, "Those who have tested the feature say it is a, a, a yeah." It says, "Those." It says, "Those who have tested the feature says it is a little buggy for now. Of course, it is still working the stuff out, so you have to give Google time to work out the bugs here." Uh, but Google will certainly work out. Well, well, Google will certainly work out. Work hard on having the bugs fixed by the time the so-called key for Wi-Fi downloading is ready to be launched. If you are the type of, if you're the type that loves to download apps, you might find this will save you a decent chunk of data every month. But if you don't got Wi-Fi, you're screwed, guys. So you guys should see the screenshots right here. That's that's what they look like. Let me uh, let me click on one of the screenshots here. So I'm guessing that I guess I'm guessing that this is what the new thing will uh, be look like. I'll so say download the app over mobile network. It says beta it says to avoid data charges, you can press pen to download until there's Wi-Fi. It tells you the app size. For an example, what if this app is 13 megabytes? You know, ask do you want to download now or wait for Wi-Fi? And they will ask you, do you want to do it once or do it always? So it will, it will uh, do that. So that's what the thing will look like. And the second one. It's basically the same thing as the first one. So, uh, yeah, this is um, pretty interesting, guys. So if you guys download a, download a large file, I will ask you all. Uh, do you want to wait for Wi-Fi? Do you want to just do it once or always? Um, it will give you a warning, so just be prepared for that. If you do not have an unlimited data plan, you have to be careful about that. Excuse me. Uh, but pretty much every carrier now has unlimited data, even though you know most carriers do throw your data. Um, you can still download the apps when the uh, data is throttled. It'll just take a long time. Uh, so you just have to be patient for that if you're trying to download the apps on throttle speed so you just have to be patient for that um, but it is possible you just have to have patience for that if you're trying to download uh, 
absence of uh, 128 kilobytes a second. So you just have to be patient about that if you uh, do end up going every day for whatever reason. But that's why um, that's why that they'll ask you do you want to use Wi-Fi or or discontinue. So um, yeah, uh, this is an interesting feature here. Um, some people have some people have got new feature, and some people have said that it's a bit buggy right now. But that's okay, because you know it's a new feature, and Google will hopefully work out all the bugs, and hopefully when it's rolled out completely, uh, it will be smooth sailing. But we just have to wait and see when it's rolled out completely. Um, so um, if you guys have gotten this uh, feature yet, l l let me know what you guys think about it. Is if you guys have uh, noticed a new feature yet on your Play Store. Um, so uh, yeah, this is very interesting, guys. Like I said. And I figured I'd bring it to you guys' attention that uh, that might find it interesting, guys, and helpful and whatnot. And uh, it might help you save on your data plan. I personally don't give a shit because I have unlimited data anyway, so I don't care. I will download uh, apps at um I will download apps at 128 kilobytes a second. I do it all the time, so it is what it is. I have patience for that, so um yeah. Uh, that's all. Uh, pretty much it, guys. Uh, you know. Like I said, this thing can Google. It's very interesting, and we'll see. Uh, yeah, hopefully when it's rolled out uh, completely, it will, uh, it will run smoothly. But we we'll just have to wait and see for that. Some people have already tested out the feature, and they said it's it's a bit buggy. Like I said, and hopefully Google, hopefully Google will work out all the bugs and stuff like that. So we we'll just have to wait and see on that. Um, so that uh, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up, guys. It really helps me out a lot. Make sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Links and those are in the description box video. Please rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.